Okay, y'all, we are on our way. We're about to hit the road. We are officially leaving Midland and starting our new journey. Um, this has been years coming and we are super excited. And so I have the kids in the back. Are y'all ready? Yes. Are y'all so excited? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right, y'all, here we go. Hey, loves. So we did a thing. So as you can see, we are in a different place. So for those of you who do not know, we moved. And not just to a different place, we moved to a different location. We have changed our zip code and we are super, super excited about it. So this is going to be our official empty apartment tour because my husband and I made a very intentional decision to rent for the first year or so, so we can save uh, more money and purchase our house, and not just any house, purchase uh, the house that we will be in for a while. Um, so I'm gonna give y'all a tour. I'm super excited! I cannot believe that we did it, right? Right smack dab in the middle of the pandemic. So, as you come in, this is going to be the dining room area, right here. And it opens right up to this patio and I can access this patio from the living room area or from our master bedroom, okay? So this is gonna be the dining room area. All of this space is the living room area and it has tall ceilings as you can see. All this natural light, which I am so far excited about. Um, and then when you move over to the left, this is going to be the kitchen, granite countertops. And so I love how open this is because we can also put some additional seating right here. And then of course, undermounted seats, all stainless steel appliances, and then a ton of cabinet space, which you very rarely get in apartment complexes, but this one has tons of storage. And then right here we have our washroom. And then when you walk through the living room area, the first room we're going to get is Zane's room right here. Not all the bony Zane. This is going to be baby boy's room. And again, see all the high ceilings, good, big window. And then he also has a great closet, which is really good. So lots of storage in there. And then when we walk through, then we're gonna walk into the girls room, which is this room right here. So again, super big. Um, this has a ton of room in it. This is much bigger than their last room. And the closet on this is ridiculous, okay? So we are thinking about, since they're doing some, since they're doing some homeschooling right now, we're going to possibly, um, we could put a desk in here up against this wall, and then we could put one out here. That way they can have some privacy while they're on classes. But this is a really good size room. And since they have their bunk beds, which in my previous video, you saw us putting those bunk beds up together. We did do that a couple of weeks ago. And yes, then we ended up moving, which was fine. Uh, so they'll still have a ton of space in their room to lounge around in. Now what's really unique about this room is it opens straight up to the bathroom. And this is going to be the guest bathroom. You see the countertops, tons of storage space, and then a good shower. Look at the shower head. Cause they're not nuts. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. 
And then again, the granite countertops, good size window, I mean mirror. And yeah, so this is a really, really dope bathroom. And so you can also walk out through here. So this will be the entrance for guests. And then you'll walk back through the common living area space into our master. So our master is right off of the front door. And so when you walk in, once again, a good space. Um, so this is really, really nice. And then we have a nice size closet, which is amazing. So super excited about this. I can't wait to do um, another closet clean out for y'all. I know how much y'all appreciated and loved that last video. I actually did that um, about a couple of months ago. And so y'all loved it. And so I'm going to do another one for you. And then if you walk this way, you're going to come into the master bathroom. As you can see right here, the tub. You can see right here the tub. Um, and so my husband is going to love that because he loves to soak after he's worked out. And then again, granite countertops. Yo. <laughs> I have not seen a medicine cabinet in ages, right? <laughs> so, a medicine cabinet, y'all know what I'm talking about. If you in 80s, 90s, baby, you know what I'm talking about. Good size mirror. And then once again, we have amazing storage down here at the bottom, which is really, really nice. And then, of course, storage above the toilet for towels. And then if you head out here, this, I have to be honest, is one of the things that I'm most excited about. Uh, in our last place, the, the kids really didn't have room to stretch out, run, play um, at the house. And so this is something that, man, it's a game, it was a game changer for us. So you can actually access the patio from the master bedroom and the dining room area. So let's take a step out here. If I know how to <laughs> how to work the doors. No, let me. So if we step outside. We step outside, it has a good size patio area, which is right here. This is our dining room area. And then the master, which is right here. And then as you can see, look how dope this is. The kids can run right out on to the playground. So this playground is right outside of our patio area. And so this is going to be amazing. So while we are inside, or whether we're entertaining, the kids have a space to run around. Look how beautiful this is out here. This is amazing. And then of course the pool is just over there. And so I love the fact that our apartment opens up to the green area for the kiddos. And then as you can see, Zane is already already active on the playground so it is going to be such an amazing um, next couple of years so at least the kids have that and we have some things to do while we are quarantined and then I don't know if y'all can also see that but there is also a splash pad in that area over there which is really really nice so I can't wait to just kind of get settled in and get unpacked. Uh, so yeah, and put this house together. So when we moved, we did sell a lot of stuff. I mean, quite a bit of stuff, um, but that was intentional. 
And so we're going to repurchase some of the things, but we were able to sell our fridge, we were able to sell couches and all of those things. Listen, the name of the game is to downsize, save, and be intentional, y'all. So this next year, uh, year and a half, we are going to be grinding uh, very hard. Um, this is somewhere where we have been desiring to be for many, 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 many years, and we are super excited about it. So we can't wait to take y'all on this journey. enjoyed the house tour and I will see you in the next one. Bye loves.